everyone. How y'all doing today? Hope everybody's doing good. I'm doing really good. I've been really busy um, trying to get my craft room up and running. I have come a long way. I have been, I've been working non-stop in my craft room from the time I get up of a morning and get my husband off, the, uh, off to go walking until I just crash in the afternoon and I've been at that for uh, close to a week but the last three four days I have really been at it and I'm gonna get back at it again today because I want to start crafting and I can start crafting because I could pull everything into the other room and get some stuff done I mean, I don't want to run back and forth for everything. Let's just put it that way. I don't want to dig a bunch of stuff out and then have to bring it back in and put it all away. I want to be in my room where when I need something, I just grab it, put it back, and be done. I'm going to adjust you guys just a little bit here. Okay. I feel like I'm miles away. Anyway, um, as you can see, I still don't have this area done. This is going to be shelves um, right here. This is like, uh, in you know, see here's my hand. It goes in. Well, there's a couple of like two by fours. I guess you call them two by fours. Anyway, boards, whatever. That are holding all this. This is all open. This opens up into my front porch. Um, coat room. Anyway, my husband this spring is going to replace that and he's going to be making this uh, a little deeper and then he'll he'll put me some shelves in here so that I can put stuff on those shelves <sighs> sometimes I think I'm never gonna get on but I did get the totes out of storage got through all of them there was four four totes in storage um, there was a tote in my my bedroom two totes in the bedroom and then there was like tons just in whatever we could find to put it in anyway when you empty a craft room and you've been crafting for 10 years watch out because you collect a lot and and not only that I had a lot of friend mail that I I'll be honest, I was hoarding it. Because you get such pretty things, you don't want to use it. So you you put it up, and I would bag it up like this. And I would put the person's name on it. And I was storing it in totes. Come on, you guys. That's not smart. Let's use our stuff, right? So... I may not know what you guys sent me, like I said in my other video, because I took it all out and I made it available. <laughs> Bag just fell. Anyway, <laughs> this is mostly a chit-chat video, if you didn't catch that by now. I just wanted to give you guys a little bit of update on what I've been doing. Not only um, are we doing, uh, am I working in my craft room? My husband is working in the kitchen, so I'm having to empty cabinets and drawers and, you know, get stuff out of his way, so I have things everywhere. And so I've been trying to, you know, help him by keeping things done up, and then I have to cook, and then I have to clean up afterwards. So this month is really going to be a hit and miss with my videos. But come February, you guys, I am so looking forward to getting into my scrapbooking. I have my, I found my book that I wanted to alter and make a journal out of it. I haven't done a journal. Uh, Esther Luca uh, had it on her channel where she gave step by step in three or four different videos on how to take the pages out and make a journal and and not just her there's others like uh uh lolly uh palusa um uh, i think donna jackson did it uh there's there there's several that i have watched and you know i want to i want to get busy and do some stuff and 
Like I said, this year I'm making all my Christmas gifts and for my adult children. Uh, now, my kids, my grandkids, the ones that are small, you know, I'm going to get them something. Uh, but the adults, I'm going to make them something. Um, have ideals, of which I'll take you guys along with. Um, I'm going to be scrapbooking and all kinds of good stuff. And what else do I have to share? Happy New Year, if I didn't tell you. I hope you guys had a great Christmas and a great New Year. And um, I got some nice stuff. My, uh, if you watched my video before this, it's just a very short video. It just gave, uh, uh, I had a couple of pictures that I had taken of my new computer desk my daughter made me. My youngest daughter it has been making me my furniture. Now, if I could get some drawers in here, I would have it made. So, I don't know how we're going to do that yet. But, it has been just busy. But I posted a short video with some pictures of uh, a few things that I'm doing. And I do have another picture. Uh, if you saw my video, you saw I had file holders on my wall. And at the end of this, I'm going to insert a video, uh, not a video, but a picture of how I'm using those file holders. So, you know, maybe, maybe you might like to try that because it does save room. If you have enough space to do it I actually am going to add probably two more uh, sections one on top and one on the bottom I'm not sure yet or one on the side because I need at least uh, six more and anyway I'll show you guys a picture of what I'm talking about but um, yeah it's been busy I got some wonderful friend mail which I'm going to share with you guys in a in a video after this one uh, like I said, I just wanted to give you guys an update. I have new subscribers. Oh my God, thank you guys for, for subscribing to my channel. You are so, so welcome to my channel. And I'm happy that you chose to subscribe. And I hope you stick around. I know it's kind of boring at times. Uh, but, you know, not every video is going to be for you. Uh, let's see what else I got to share. My granddaughter got me new a caterpillar. That was what I was going to tell you guys, the, the, the caterpillar cutter. Uh, that's on my video. I think that's where I was going with the video before this, and then I lost the train of thought. I still have uh, my board that I put pegs in to hang stuff. That's still got to be installed in my room. Uh, let's see. There is going to be a video of a before and after when, when I'm done. So, look forward to sharing that. But for now, you guys, I think that's it. I think I've updated you guys about as much as I can at this moment. Um, you guys have any questions for me, feel free to ask. I always answer any questions or I always try to um, respond to comments. Now... I will be honest, if you leave a comment on an older video, I may miss it, but I do appreciate them, and I do try to catch every single one, but, um, you know, and last time I looked, I was at 499 subscribers, I need one more, but I have seen that sometimes I'll be at 499 and it'll drop back to 496 or 97 don't know don't know if it's YouTube or if you know I have people that oh well I just you know don't want to hang around anymore anyway when I reach because of everything that's going on I'm not going to try doing a challenge at this time I would normally I would try and do a 500 subbies challenge but I'm going to wait till I get to 600. When I reach 600, I will do a challenge or a giveaway. Either way, it'll be a giveaway because I'm going to give something away. Um, so, let's see if we can get me to 600 so we can do a challenge. I know I said I was going to do it at 500, you guys, but... 
bear with me. It's It's been too hectic. I just cannot. I have joined a couple of swaps, which isn't a problem because they're small. I have decided this year with postage going up, um, I'm sorry, I'm trying to make this short, but I want to make sure I get it. I, I, I want to talk. What can I say? Um, with postage going up, I will be not I will be not. <laughs> I will not be joining as many swaps because I don't want to commit myself to more than I can afford to ship out on time. So I'm going to try and limit to either flat rate. <laughs> well, not really flat rate. Well, that's not the word I'm looking for. Let me tell you. I want to be able to send it like this, flat, like an envelope. So those kind of swaps, I won't have a problem joining. Uh, I will join bigger swaps, but just not as many. Like uh, I just I signed up for the Esther Luca family swap, her Valentine swap. I wouldn't miss that for nothing in the world. Uh, Esther Luca is is one of the ladies that I mainly started doing swaps on their channel when the others quit doing it, because I was in a few and they just uh, th there was so much um, what do you call it flakers that and people not satisfied that they they quit doing it. So that was when I found Esther's channel and started doing uh, joining her swaps. Now I am. No way an expert at crafting, you guys. When you get something for me, it comes from the heart. I do the best I can. Um, yeah, there are some things that I'm trying to improve on, like my card making and uh, my pocket letters. I'm trying to come up and be more creative with those. And, you know, anything that, that we're doing now, I'm trying my darndest. <laughs> To get more creative. Just understand that when you partner with me, you're getting somebody that's really doing it from the heart and for, for fun and because I want to make friends. I'm not a professional. So, what can I say? Anyway, you guys, besides that, I got nothing. <laughs> I'm going to get off of here because I think I've done and bored y'all's ears long enough. And... I'll catch you guys in another video. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. Help me reach that 600 uh, subbies and we will do a giveaway or a challenge and a giveaway. We'll do something. So, God bless each one. Have a great day, you guys. I'll catch you later in the next video. Bye.